Like I have so many decisions, so many tables. Come on, two outs. I win. I didn't see that. <laughs> I have, uh, this week I'm starting a YouTube series on my run in this tournament two weeks ago. And I'm gonna go over every single hand and we're gonna release that uh, on YouTube together with Jordan, of course. And I hope that you guys like that. Aces! Tips to start playing poker. Okay, guys, just check out, yeah, Learn with Lex series on YouTube. Learn with Lex. That's probably the, honestly, that's gonna be your best resource. Wow! <clears throat> All right, welcome to the land of very, very few bluffs. Crazy hand. Yo, Poker Nuts, what's up, bro? Welcome, welcome. Welcome to the army. Yeah. Rough. <laughs> but we win a nice amount of chips. Like these, uh, I played this, for, this buy-in has a very low player field. Proceeds to not shove the river with stack to pot ratio of 40. 0.4, I guess. Call the three bets. How do I balance these bets? Ace queen and under Paris. Yo, Mortis Draco, what up? Great, and we get paid. Got okay, aces again, wow. This is my first, this is one of the first starts I watched since like Schumacher days. I just check, right? I guess. Yeah, I just check. 100 big blind pot though, not bad. Oh, 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 we're all in. Well, they're all in. Nice. Cool, easy call. Pour la bounty. Nice. I'm gonna flat because I think that everybody that comes along, I dominate. Well, I have a big chance of dominating, so. Of course, the big blind's gonna call along, which is a problem, but still, like, my hand plays so well post. It's important for me to have good flats. Now I have the nuts. Um, I guess I'm just calling. Two bounties in there. I don't think that recreationals are generally very good at balancing. It's great news. Short stack still in. Long time ago you said you wanted to move somewhere else in the world. Why did you come back to Netherlands? Uh, we want to start a family. We want to start a family, be home, close to everybody. Drive to survive, right? Bounty! Bam! Nice. Wow, look at this.
Can we win another? We hundred and twenty five dollars in bounties already. Sick. Man, this is a great run. Um, they're gonna three bet quite a bit because they got this stack here. All in, which is obviously a very weak range. I feel like I'm just gonna have to defend it by shoving here. Man, it's 60 bigs. God damn, it's so sick. I feel my hands are tied. Oh my god. The other hand is so sick. Base jack. Wow, holy fuck. $80 in bounties. Holy shit, what a pot. Look at that. Would you like free tickets to Pink Floyd in Belgium? That's very, very kind of you. I won't be able to go, but it's insanely kind. Our conversation about it was also just saying like, I'll oh, just pay it off, I don't want to fold it. It's not even, yeah. It felt pretty easy to me. This is actually a bad card for me. Like, obviously I'm still gonna call all in. I don't think he's betting a queen with a spade on the turn, but he still has ace. Actually, I think that he's also checking like ace nine, ace at a spade, so we're absolutely fucking fine. It's a big pot. We're running like God in this tournament. We must be first. Oh, we're second, what? <laughs> But then third is a long way away. Hmm? Oh. Hey, deuce. Um. Wow. Look at this. Fake flip if I've ever seen one. Yeah! I can't lose a hand. I can't and will not lose. Queens. Wow, look at this. Look at this, look at this. Can the train keep rolling? Holy fuck. $75 bounty. That's fucking massive. $62 there. That's three, three fucking starting bounties. I mean, what are you doing? Come on, let's go. Nines, fives? Come on. Holy shit. This is insane. $400 in bounties already. What the F? Okay, interesting. I should be bluffing her quite easily because this stack never has a good ace because they just jam it pre. Oh, it just gives it up. It's pretty uh, surprising actually. Broader now, you know? What's this? Spell the streaming? No, I will not stop streaming. What are you doing? <laughs> I always get super paranoid when somebody says, like, says that in the chat because that makes me think like, what? Don't say that. <laughs> what if other people see it and think that's true, you know? But no, I'm not stopping streaming. Wow, I can't lose an answer. Pure bubble. Uh, maybe this is not so good because they're not gonna call on the pure bubble. Nah, okay. Okay, not sure if I like this. I should have an insane amount of fold equity and have a great blocker to do this with, etc. So that that's there are forgiving circumstances here, but it's like oh, okay. Well, this should actually make them fold. Because if they double and they get knocked out, they they bubble. Like, I have no idea what's happening on other tables, obviously, so... Maybe he's seeing, like, two 10 big blind stacks bust now and he can just free roll the all-in. Okay, well, I'm all-in, so... Great. Yes! Scuba loop. Nice! In the money. Fucking insane stack. Uh, this is pretty interesting. Get three bets. Try flop. Do we just jam our pairs? Like, what are we gonna see about three bit blinds? Okay, I guess I jam versus that size. That's such a bad card, actually. This can't win anymore. Straight out, straight up wins is two outs. Sunday Eliminator. Wow. New tournament. Okay, this is an all in. 40 bigs. We're gonna ISO. Hope we don't run into any traps. Whoa. We did, but. 
Don't make it disgusting. Amazing. Holy shit, we win the side as well. This is the most insane run. Holy fuck. <laughs> Man, we have $670 in bounties. Like, let's take a look how crazy that is compared to the number two in bounties in this tournament. This has to be the most absurd amount. The second place is 287. I have 670. Ridiculous. Wow. Uh, let's see, we have one and a half times. All right, it's so obviously not considering queen high for any calls, so we can just snap fold. Pocket threes for 13 bigs. Keep the run going. What? Like he's gonna three bet. I don't know why. It's very important to bet this. There's so many combinations he can call with from the big blind. He has an insane amount of gut shots, 9x, 7x. Still some ace x obviously as well, especially in these positions. Used to talk. Wow, 80% of a royal flush. Buddha Barn Press, I did not. Nice. A side versus Jack High. This is also something that. Um, Okay. This is really good. Okay. Uh, okay, yes, obviously I have to call four and a half lines. We're gonna bust out queens here, watch. Because you have all the strong hands. Alright, so let's get back into our bounty winning groove. So far, so good. That's not good. Fives, raise. It sucks that Spraggy covers us. Well, I mean, it goes for anybody. We're gonna get attacked a lot. This is really nice though, because we're ahead here. Often enough, that it all but locks it up. Nice. Okay, this is good. So now we cover some people again. We have 725 in bounties. Uh, check raising the flop. I think that I can have some check raise bluffs. I have some ace highs here, but I hit so much in this. I hit so much here that. Um, sorry, Watson is obviously super tough to play against. So I have to think a little bit here. Oh, I think we're just calling here. Huge pot. Nice. Well, not nice. I mean, like, it's nicer than losing to King 10. Nice over Kings, you know what I mean? What's a big pot? Let's see what he had. Aces. Wow. Met Wanderer Pro in Prague as well. Uh, Paris. Really nice guy. Obviously, they've given him a lot of props over the years online. He's a very good player. Oh, this is a dono. Uh oh. <laughs> wow, nice. Good shit. Final table. What's first in this Hot 109 on a Sunday? It is, let's say 4K with my bounty. First is 4K, huh? Okay, Ace King, here we go. $184 bounty is the final table. Come on. Fade it, please. Ah, you it's nice. <laughs> Never in doubt. Never in doubt. I did a little shout. But hey. Aces. Little clicky. 27 big blinds. 
I love gold! I'm a genius. Fucking right. Oh my god, that feels good. That's pretty nice, 60 big blinds. 1100 in bounties already. Uh, yeah, four big blinds. I think I need to call this. I need to try and win all the bounties at the table. Easy. Doesn't change my position at all either. So, I think that's fine. Pew pew, pew 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 pew. After my 3x, I'm gonna have to be calling here. If they do shove. King Queen. That's a good shove. Oh man, that's such a huge difference on my final table. Uh, well, it isn't really, but it's definitely a big momentum hit. Because like, okay, let's put it this way. If I win that, I can almost start open ripping anything that looks semi-decent, you know? Even though people don't really have the incentive to fold a lot on bounty builder final tables, because uh, it's good to be able to win bounties. Still, if everyone's short, then yeah, there's gonna be a bounty uh, introduced. We say to a race for value here. If he limp raises, I can call. Great flop. We hit this board a lot, so we can safely see bet. Against limp calls from a small blind, you want to be very careful on jack 10 8, queen jack 9. This is good. It is true. All right, so blind versus blind. Just gonna check call. Very happy to see not a bet on the river there. Interesting, let's... Mm, okay. We're gonna flat a lot because of Spraggy, but the Spraggy shoves, I get the ISO. And it's good because I have an ace, so I block a, a lot of strong traps. All right, so now we're gonna jam. $300 bounties, kind of a, sort of a nice incentive. Let's hope they weren't trapping. They weren't. Ace high versus king high. I want to make a joke because Spraggy always moans that he runs so bad versus me. Let's see how these queens fare. What's man is man. Nice. Four big blinds, I think we have to call. Yeah, just because of all of those. Come on. Ah, oh, what a time to start lo start start losing all ins, huh? Final table, fuck. All right, we're still in second. All right, well, we need some blood at this table. We're still in second behind this, but precarious situation nonetheless. Oh, lucky Spraggy. This person busts, he skips the big blinds. There it is. Pretty tilting, I have to call 1.3 big blinds for Spraggy. Spraggy never wins a hand against me, according to him. Except for when he does. Uh, I think I have to go again. He has like zero... He has zero uh, reasons to fold. This motherfucker. Always moans. Always moans that he's running bad. Wins, what, five all-ins in a row? On a fucking final table, mate. Alright, another ace high versus king high. Come on! Okay. $600 bounty on me if people knock me out. That's great for when I have hands like this. Because then I'll call with a hand like king king five or something, right? King four hands I just do really well against. Oh man, this final table was so fucking frustrating. Holy shit. Man, how many fucking all-ins did I lose? Oh, that sucks. Where all the money gets divided. If I win this tournament, I get a fucking bag. This is still nice for this tournament though, but... Jesus Christ. That was painful to watch. GG though. 
GG. And let's register the $1,000 tournament immediately in its place. All right, so we're gonna limp card with Queen 7 suited. Great flop. It's not bad. Pressure. Pressure reduce, pressure at 10. Um, because it's blind on blinds, I think I can check this. Uh, he still has a hand like Jack 3, Jack 4, Jack 5, Jack 6, Jack 7. You know, you can have some 9x of, die, nine x of hearts that, he'll, that he might check. I think that we still win enough versus enough random hands to not turn us into a bluff. I would have some random low hearts or something, right? Um, yeah, that's good. Nice. Okay. Um, let's see. Four big blinds. That's good. Really good. Здорово. God was amazing. What a fight. Gonna bet for value here. Uh, they could be very balanced still, but I don't think they're checking straights behind. Shouldn't be too many sets. Five hundred tournament. We can get some value. Keep an eye on the satellites for the 5k, of course. We've got a massive stack here. 107 bigs. Really great uh, turn here for us to bet. So we don't get flush versus flushed. So I think we have to call two flush draws there, some straight draws. And we check the flop back, so I feel like any pair that we check back, we have to call. If we're gonna balance that way, you know. Good shit. Important spot at the stage of the tournament. Win a big bounty. $101. We're chip leading now. Last 15. That's four spots away from the money. Very nice. I randomized this. If somebody pulls this shit on one of the... The, the targets in the game and they, they say something like that, they never get to play again. That's how it works. They'll never get to play again. And that's a fact. Nice. I think to pe in people's eyes it's important for the sport for him not to be that person. I think that's part of it, you know? Jam this call through but from the big blinds. So he's not trapping. And I think I need to call here as well. Nice. Mm, okay, let's just go all in. Thousand dollar buy in. Ouch. Fox were amazing quality for interesting to have a look behind seeing the highlights and hands of the big game stay amazing. Nice! Nice, bro. Thank you. Six makes it straight. Mm. I think I'm gonna bet again for protection and some value. I don't think he has a whole lot of 6x in his range. Like, are you telling me that on the pure bubble he's limp calling 6 3 suited? No. King 6 off? No. I don't believe all that for a second. 
great spot if my fucking hotkey works. Queen Hyper's Jack High, look at that. So let's see if we can get away with this. A king or a deuce? Wow. Uh oh. Nice. It's definitely something to work with. Sorry, it's just so stressful. Like, I have so many decisions, so many tables. Come on. Two outs. <laughs> I win. I didn't see that. <laughs> I win. I didn't see it. I'm going to be honest. I could, I could do the whole, like, oh, come on, yes. I didn't see it. That's fine. I'm hyper-focused on aces and nines. Also, it's the bounty 215s. <laughs> what the fuck do you expect me to win? But that was a big boy bounty. Right there. And I'm very happy. I'm elated, in fact. I'm elated. That's why I smashed the table. It's an expression of emotion. I'll break again. Not bad. Uh, jack high might call for chop. Or anything. I mean, I say jack high, but four high might call for chop, right? So. Okay. Okay. Very good. Wow, we get a great shelf spot here. The small one, we're gonna get caught by tons of hands. 10-8 off, for instance. But another ace versus king high, and it looks like this time we win. Sound like the Family Guy intro. Not bad. We're just gonna call. Don't really look like we have anything. Showing in a 1k again with ace jack. Huge spots. Let's take our eyes on this one. While we easily get value here. Uh oh. Dead. GG1k. Always tough. Bleeding a little bit. But that's okay. Gonna limp jam this one. 30 big lines. I mean, okay, I call. Fuck of fours. There's a nine. Holy shit, what a nice flip to win. That's huge. Huge, huge hand. We now cover the Bounty Daddy, which is great. Massive spot here. Just gonna check call again. There's no need to raise, right? It's like if we raise, we don't get value from Ace Queen or, you know, like Queen Jack. It's so hard to think about hands that will call a check raise. Uh, awful, let's hope that they just have something that checks and loses, but fucking awful river, holy fuck. Okay, jam. Uh, I got a three bets. If you're wondering when to slow play here, it's when you have a stack that can get it in relatively easy over two or three streets. When you defend a big blind, preferably two streets. We got aces in one of our biggest tournaments. We are, in fact, going towards the money here. 530 marathon. We won this last time we were playing it. Great stuff. It's generally a great day of food for me. I eat super clean. I can't play any music to you guys, but I feel like it helps me now because the, the silence works. Uh, no, Jam, I think. He has, a, he has more jack x than he has queen x, right? Let's hope it almost snapped. Because then it's a queen. <laughs> well, I mean, he should snap king jack where he's jack, so. Who the fuck really knows, huh? Ten Hag out? Oh, come on. No. Okay, deep in the 530 marathon. Only places get paid. 13th. Well, we're close. Man, grow the fuck up. Mm hmm. Maybe 
Maybe try a new mouse cup. <laughs> Let's see what you're doing. Yeah, yeah. Alright, final table. This format reinstall system did everything. I didn't even make, I didn't even make, uh, how do you say that? I didn't even make uh, memory points or whatever. Huge spots, final table. Oh my god, my computer. My fucking computer is driving me nuts. It's driving me insanely nuts. I can't click buttons, man. All right, here we go. Final table time. Uh, I have no idea where to look. Nice, $112. Easy katka. That means I'm timing out somewhere. Um, this is good. We're chip leading. What's first? A thousand. Yeah, good luck. Good hand to do this with. Nice. Fuck off, man. Uh, yeah, we're just gonna jam this board out of position. My hotkeys are not working because my PC is dog shit. Because my PC is dog shit. It just stops working when I resize a fucking table. Is this the most mad somebody's ever been winning a tournament or what? Are you sure the computer's plugged in? <laughs> I don't know! Frodo! Nice queen on the flop. Oh, that's fine. It's fine. Easy, let's go. Bankroller. Just never gonna win this fucking guy. I guess this fucking guy. Fucking Mr. Fucking one year straight hot run. Alright, cool. Nice little soft bubble there to top it all off. $150 bounty at large. It's Irish King Eye. This has not been good so far for me today. Am I am I gonna win one of these or no? Nice. <laughs> Moan it in! <laughs> not bad. Never seen someone so pissed off on winning a thousand. <laughs> yeah. True. All right, Our heads up for the win. It was not one. And we're jamming ourselves here. Well, that's a small blind flat. Then all of a sudden we see a lot of calls. <laughs> Great. Nice. I give up, man. There's not playing the fucking tournament. All right, this should be barreling us off our socks here. We're just gonna flat. Five thirty bounty. Okay. The call heads up. It's a flip. It's a race. We got folds with our hands, and we just lose another one. Ha! <laughs> we don't. We win. If you're wondering, if you're seeing this in some sort of highlight, let me immediately put an exclaimer. Why am I so mad? My computer is fucking crashing all the time. But hey, I'm happy we won a tournament. First out of 70, $2,000. Thank you very much. I will take that very gladly. And this is going to put us onto bigger and better things, for sure. <laughs> Woo! Yeah, this is one of those sessions where you just feel like you're gonna lose your marbles. Um, gonna bet again. I don't think I'm gonna get check raised or should get check raised almost ever. And 
I really want to get rid of uh, pairs that are under a king. Final table. Let's go. Queens in the $1,000 tournament. I don't like this for a final table theme. Oh, this is more. This is better, actually. This is a good time to put music on. Let's get laser focused. Lex does not tilt. He does not. He gets really fucking mad, though. But he does not play worse. Let that be a lesson. Uh, he just leads? What the? Wow! I mean, if he just leads, like, big again, I just jam? Oh. It's a bad river. I think that's... Genuinely, he's gonna bluff raise a lot of 7x on his boards. Also call, I guess. Ah, oh, man, it's not a big bet. Nice. Um, I bet pretty big, which means that I actually draw out a lot of the ace highs. So I'm just gonna bet for value here with my king. He's gonna have to defend a lot of 9x, king x. Very important to realize like how bet sizing affects boards and you know board textures and ranges. He does. He deserves. He, he has some huge scores, obviously, but not like the. So that's very cool. And it looks like I'm gonna have to take the spots. I'm by far the shortest stack. We have one of the biggest stacks raising, so we're gonna be ahead of his range here. I just need to get it in. Oh, that's unfortunate. Is it though? I guess the good thing is you can just go back and watch more. <laughs> um. Um, I'm gonna jam. Nice, 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 nice. So good. This is too bad. Maybe. It's really nice to shove King Queen because you unblock all of his Asex uh, bluffs. Very hard for him to have hearts with me having the Ace of Hearts. Very cutthroats, some big stacks. Everybody's very close to me. If I win a decent side pot, all of a sudden I'm third or, or second, you know, depending who I win against. Then I can see if I need to, like, if there's any songs that are, have a big chance of coming. I'm just gonna fire this off. He's gonna snap call a king. Just putting a lot of pressure on a three, a seven. Under pairs, obviously. I think once I bet the turn, I should know that I'm not winning anymore, right? I think the turn is a little bit too good to check. Also, if I check, I never have a king or a jack. Uh, big binds are not going well. It's crazy. It's so frustrating in a session, you know, you get fourth in a tournament, second in a tournament, you're on a final table of one. But then if you do poorly in your 1k 500, 500s and fucking 5k's.
Nice. Taking down a little bit. We're getting super short on the final table. Not much we can do. We've been playing our hands, I think, correctly. I think the Queen Jack off was an open. Okay, it's an easy shove. Come on. Oi. Oh, well, I mean, I guess it's fucked. I still. Ah, GG. GG, GG. We got seventh cash for twelve hundreds. Okay, okay. Two Brazilian gangsters. Not today. Uh, Ninety nine problems. Okay, this range is dust, or else he'd be isoing. They have some traps in there. Cover the big blinds. Let's uh, fucking go. Bears do really well on these kind of spots. I mean, this is already amazing. Yeah. All right, no jack. <clears throat> My higher binds aren't doing well. All right, it's one kid knockouts. A lot of the Brazilians live as well have been doing this 3.5x open thing as a standard. This is a great fucking river, holy shit. Okay, is there any point in raising? I mean, I guess so, yeah. Lose kings versus queen there. I mean, I'd be so curious. I mean, it doesn't matter. Like, he's just gonna pick the bottom of his range as a bluff. If I min raise, will I ever get called by like 8 9? That's the question, right? That's that's the reason why we raise. Is he checking the flop that with 8 9? Probably not. Anyway, nice spot. Just thinking out loud there. But it's just like sometimes it just feels like why 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 am I even if if Joey does a th just does a camp a thing like that I don't know you know this is a great fucking turn in a one k can only lose to plus rolls if you go to the giveaway channel you'll find it there that's too bad that they folded we're gonna get jammed on here all the time. <laughs> okay. You want to jam? New. No. One cake. Oh, shit. Oh, nice. Come back hands. Nice, nice, nice. A breath of life. Hmm. Well, we can't get shoved on. It's a tough spot, so. All right, this is a really good spot. Oh, should I just jam? I think I might. I kind of like this spot. If he has aces, I'm just going to retire. <laughs> yeah. I think that kings are either or. I like jamming. Okay. We're gonna jam here. Hmm, that's pretty unfortunate. Nice hands. Oh, wow, I even covered them. 
That's good though, I got a little second chance there. Wouldn't have changed anything in my strategy in that hand, so that's good. It's not like I punted, thank god. Whoa. Not sure if this is the size, but I love it. Forty bigs in the middle, wow. It's turned into quite a hand. Nice. Click it a click. Okay. Good. Two outs. Sick! Nice. Only lose against King Queen here. Wow, great river, holy shit. I think he checked through a jack a lot, or so some tens, sort of 10 combination, and he's just gonna call, so. Oh, he's gonna call a lot with those, right? He's never folding a jack after he checks a flop behind, so. Pretty nice, though. Oh, let's check, of course. Sorry, guys. Queen jack, yeah. Oh, the queen is a problem for him. But yeah, this is really nice. I, uh... I just don't like what they did in real life or, you know, whatever. This is, Klansky is just a weird guy. Read some weird stories about him. Do you watch the darts? Yeah, I watch occasional darts. I'll take a four here. Or king. Not gonna read into this. Be a bit mad. Busted versus queen three. I mean, yeah, it's fine, guys. I mean, like, it's, it's a bit, it's a bit of a... Silly question, 19 year eternity plan or something. Or I don't know, maybe he thinks that. It, it's a bit of a silly question, but I don't feel like there's a uh, much of venom in it. Oh, I need to bluff. Uh, yeah, so I'm gonna get snap called by 87, sure. But I need to find some bluffs. Blocking all the straights is quite nice. Ridiculous. Two of the world's best. Almost three times, so we should be able to use better this. And I have full confidence there is going to be a jack. Mm. Pretty good card for us. I don't think there's any ace fives anymore. Five sixes. Uh, I think we just need a jam. All right. I kind of I like not having a jack now, you know? Mm -hmm. I mean, we need to find some bluffs. I think it's a pretty good natural bluff. do anything about that but i like the bluff also it's good to bluff also where your value cards come from so i'm gonna shove king queen ace queen aces kings yeah it's kind of funny because you immediately know that you're okay you know that's your have uh peace with it if it just happens and you're like okay you know gotta find some bluffs even in a 5k or especially in a 5k i should say we're gonna jam. It's an essential part of the game to make a bluff. Jesus. Uh, I'm just gonna bet just because of my range on this board. All right, it's GG. Oh man, I love that queen of spades. Here we go. Oh! Two snap falls. Two snap falls. Oi, oi, oi. Nice bluff. Um, fucking Sage Star. Really hard to play against this. Uh... What's crazy about the way they do it is they don't really limp. It just their whole range is like three, three and FX. I think it's a lot easier when they also employ limps for some reason. 
earth about this. And now we can just get it in. I think at this point we just check though. Okay, great pots. Uh, good start. And somebody is shorter than me, which is always great. Uh, we're gonna bet the turn, call a lens. It's very important to bet draws here that we can call a lens with. The nicest thing about this is that we dominate other draws, right? Let's say yes, has like uh, eight nine of spades, ten nine of diamonds, king nine of diamonds. We dominate those draws, which is fantastic. And then they advised us to, um, damn, those snap folds really make you regret doing this, you know? <laughs> oh fuck! I thought I, I thought I uh, covered the big line as well. No matter though. Nice. Can't lose. Very interesting. A low river would be nice. Nice pot though. A little bit of mistake to flat there, pretty for sure. Okay, look at this. We have uh, an apple to peel with this guy. Remember that insane uh, ace deuce hand versus my uh, kings on the final table? I do. It's kind of funny. We played uh, together at the PCA 25k and I said next to him, he just goes, I was sorry. I'm sorry, bro. I'm sorry for that hand. Shout out to the guy who says I never check it back. Please, homie. Okay, a little 10. Man, this is a really hard spot. Holy shit. Like, the thing I need to ask myself is, does he bet weaker aces on the turn and I have a lot of trouble figuring that out oh this is so fucked yeah oh my god this is so fucked oh my god he's not even putting one big blind behind I actually think that makes it more value for it as well but ah man I just you know what the problem is I just don't really see he's very good right so he's he's gonna find bluffs for sure but it's such an unnatural spot to bluff you know what's really hard about this you can value bet ace king ace queen ace jack kings well he doesn't maybe see with kings but probably not ace seven ace five sevens and fives and i strongly feel that he's not gonna value shove a6 ace four ace three that's the problem i just don't feel like i beat he might ace 8 and ace 9 for sure, but I just don't think the amount of bluffs the amount of bluffs plus the amount of value bets with worse measure up. But one thing I also have to consider obviously is um, if I have enough hands to call with. I mean, this is zero slow plays, right? So there's a lot of extra money for me here. So, do I just jam? I think jamming might be okay, actually. Yeah. This is never a slow play. I mean, I shouldn't say never, because there's three 30 big blind stacks behind. You can make an argument that that's worth more than playing some Omega pot deep with aces, right? Like, what are you gonna make it in position six big blinds and then play 140 big blinds deep? So there might be, but I just don't think it's enough. Plus eight is just really fucking good. Eight in a 5k. 
Tra la 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 la. Oh my god, it is a slope line. Tens and aces. Hey. I know that one. Hello? Are you from around here? Look at that. Look at the carnage. <laughs> Look at the carnage I created. I still live in Vlissinga, but I rent a house in... Uh... Definitely gonna get hero called a bunch by kings, queens, jacks, 10x. Nice. This to be very... Nice, that's good, that's good, that's good. Look at this. Uh, everybody's super deep, but Aces is the best hand to play when you're super deep. Um, too bad. It's actually kind of funny, but not slow playing Aces I actually have more chance at the bounty, <laughs> I feel. Okay, big pot. One's the cash, 11. 22 left. $35. Are you fucking kidding me right now? <laughs> He's been at, been at fucking tables with 100 big blind stacks all fucking day in this tournament. We have a seven big blind stack at the table. It just vanishes. Fucking gone. Holy shit. All right. If you could just jam ace queen, that'd be fucking great. Are you kidding me? All right. What, a, what an insanely, insanely ridiculous turn. Good shit. Four and a half big blinds left, lose honor and 14 big blind pot. That is so fucking gross. Man. Just unbelievable. I mean, I get to barrel that off and have them have to hero call with an ace high hand so fucking often. Or, a, you know, a pair of aces. It's crazy. Let's hope we get back in the game here. Holy shit. Oh, we're live. Whoopty freaking do. <sighs> Holy shit, this is so frustrating. It must be a profit today, yes. I mean, I bought him for 15k in tournaments, so I cashed for 5k, so. I did not.